The project is a place where people, can, business people particularly, who work on their own in, um, at home, uh, can come and make use of the facilities here. We've got pres um, professional facilities here for them to run their business, um, maybe things that they don't have at home. So we're basically we're a co-shared working space where people uh, they can use as a professional front for their business, use the meeting rooms, uh, bring their office here basically. There are a lot of businesses in uh, the rural areas around the, the Clondubbin town particularly which have very weak broadband and they have difficulty downloading their uh, the stuff they need for work, the various other aspects that even the phone signals can be a bit um, difficult there. So it was a question of bringing people together. We want to build up the networking facility particularly and there is definitely a need for that. We've had um, and the meeting room which is about to happen when the glass screen arrives. Um, that will make all the difference because we will have a meeting room that will be secluded and private. So we've got broadband facilities here, printing facilities here, laminating, anything they need to run a business really. Mm. Yeah, it's just not just for businesses. The general public can use our facilities or bring their own laptops in. We welcome them. Yes. We've even had some an inquiry who just before we opened from somebody who came from New Zealand who has seen a similar thing out there and was thrilled that uh, next time she comes there's going to be somewhere for her to use. Mm -hmm. Keep an eye on her businesses back home. Mm -hmm. We want to see the, uh, the, the benefits of this being rolled out to as many people as possible. To, uh, because we feel that the more people who come, the more the stronger the network becomes. Clondubbin Town Council had to find ways of funding this building, and we had to find a way of making this place pay. So that was when we thought of the hub. Uh, the feasibility study was set in motion. Uh, we then had to act very quickly, uh, which may have upset a few local people in the process, but now uh, they are far more positive, they know that we are looking for a new centre for heritage for the town, a bigger, better, more vibrant facility uh, using um, heritage lottery funding, and this was the first step, and without the funding from innovative communities to set this one going, uh, we would still be in the doldrums. We wouldn't have been able to manage this without the funding that we received and the help that we have had in completing the application forms, so getting the quotes in, all that sort of thing that needs to be done. The staff have been tremendously helpful. Um, I couldn't have done it without them. Come and see us at the hub in Clindabri. Come and see what the fuss is about at the Clindabri Hub. <laughs>